feel like Mother Teresa's twin brother. I know. I feel like Gandhi's dad. You know, just like I gave birth to an old, bald, famous African dude. It was touch and go for a little while, though. Yeah. I, I thought that serenade grenade was going to blow up right in Mitch's face. You never close your eyes anymore when I kiss your lips. Mitch, why are you singing? Who are these guys? Is he wearing a Bluetooth? These are the Jingleberries. They're my new friends. Okay. Now that you've stopped that nonsense, can you help me get a cab? Yeah, sure. There's something I want to talk to you about. Talk? Talk? What kind of amateur line was that? You don't talk to chicks, you sing at them. Yeah, I would have gone with a little right here, right now from High School Musical 3, or at the very least, you are the music in me from High School Musical 2. Both good calls. The kid did his own thing, and you can't argue with the results. Cupid's arrow, death struck. For chance to dream. For chance to suck face. I'll say. Do you think she would have responded to some hardcore Motown Philly action? Maybe some B to M, like end of the road or on bended knee? You know, I was thinking the exact same thing until mid-harmony, Rihanna came to me and sang, please don't stop the music. And so I didn't. That's just it. We know each other too well. I didn't stop until you stopped. You didn't stop until I stopped. I can carry the syncopated rhythms of you too while... I belt out the melodic vision of R. Kelly. Exactly. So screw acapella tradition. We don't need another member or even a whole group of strange, talented men. We just need ourselves. Girlfriends would be nice too, you know. Like usual, you read my mind. First things first. Girlfriends. Hey, hey, hey you, you. Wanna, wanna be our girlfriends? girlfriends? Why not? Why not? We're really good at singing. Nothing. Two hours out here and no chicks taking the bait. I mean, we went from Sade to Shania and then brought out the big guns with Kylie Minogue. I thought they would have done it for sure. I know. From Kylie to Aerosmith. Armageddon Affleck style. Yeah, and a strong, vibrant finish with Miss Levine. That's a killer set list. Dude, if this were college, we'd have chicks throwing bows just to get our dorm room combo key. Do -do 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 -do. Hot cross buns. Yeah. College, man. College. college. I do miss college. Truly, madly, deeply. Yeah. Guys, you're not in college anymore. Let's move on, all right? Who, who was that guy? Was that your dad? No, I'm pretty sure my dad has blonde hair. But that guy seemed wise beyond his years. Who I, was he? I don't know. And maybe he's right. I mean, we can't go to the quad on a whim and hit up an improv circle song. We can't even find a Friday night jamboree to save our lives. I can't even hold your hair back anymore when you puke at Red Lobster. Yeah, no ponytail. Why did I cut that off anyway? I think something about salmonella. But we need to move past it. We need to move past all of that. I think that mysterious pseudo father figure is right. We need to get serious. We need to hold auditions. For, for girlfriends. Or, oh. Or, I... Sure, I mean, I was thinking singing, but girlfriends is something we do need. Maybe we should just do both. I yeah, mean, just kind of cross We could have one Craigslist post for men and women. Two girls, one stone situation. Or we could just go to a unisex hair salon. And, and just and have auditions there. The 21st century barbershop quartet. Yeah, and just kind of look for both sides of the spectrum, men to and sing women. and women to be our girlfriends. Plus the acoustics in there would be amazing. They're off the charts. As long as the hair dryers are off. You never close your eyes anymore when she's laughing. Uh. <laughs>